What's up guys and in today's <coughs> video we will be doing how to learn how to do the splits. So I might open my blinds before I do this because <coughs> sorry I found voice crack. Um Open your blinds, make sure it's nice and bright in your room. Oh, much better. Now, since if you're learning how to do the splits, we're going to do the splits first and then see how much this has worked for you. So this is how close I am to the splits. So one of the important stretches is to... Go in this position and start going like this. Now we're going to go in the other leg. This is opening like your legs a bit. It's a bit of a stretch. Now, we're going to go in our straddle position and try and reach your feet, toes. Sorry, my glee came up. Now we're going to do it like together and if you're not be able to do this yet this will help you so put your foot like that and put your foot like that as far as you can so you can reach it hold it as long as you can so pause the video now now you're going to do it on the other foot. I decided to do this for like 45 seconds. Yeah, 45 seconds would do. Now, let's see how much it's already done for me from already just them stretches. I only need that much left. Now you try and see how much you have left. Now, so that was three minutes to do and we're already so close to our splits so hmm i'm not that sure what to do for your splits now all right so start to go in this position and go like this this will open up your hips only a bit but at least it might work now that you've done that you're just going to want to go in the position i told you and we're going to go down like this try and put your nose on the floor like and then go down look to the ceiling then do it again No idea. And again. No. You've got really good at that. Let's see how close I am to my splits now. And yours. Guys, also try. Well, I've finished doing my splits. 
but I'm actually quite happy and I'm proud of myself. Uh, no, don't be joking. So no, something that you can practice is a headstand. They're quite tricky for some people, but if you're like a professional, you're like, it's not tricky. Because you've been learning how to do that. So we're going to start by doing this. We're just going to keep on going like this to push our feet off. Sorry, my face is getting red. When I do handstands, go by all my I always go red. Now, all you want to do is put your feet on the wall like your heels, like this bit of your foot. So then you'll be able to. If you feel like you're going to fall, just put them on there and don't lean forwards because there might be something. Lighten forwards up here. No. So the next thing is a butterfly. So you're going to put your feet like this. Hands as far as you can. Legs down. And no touch on the floor. No, we're also going to be doing whatever this is. I'm not sure what it's called yet, yeah? but I will learn. This is what it is. Just rock and fall. Now, we are going to test how close you've got to the splits. And if you want to resume this after I've done my splits now, then you can see how much this has helped and it might help for you. And hopefully you've been following with me, so you might get your splits. I'm really close my leg. Wait, did I just? I'm going to do it again to see if I did do it. I'm not sure if I did though. No way. I did my spit. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day and hope you learn your splits. And so sorry if it doesn't help. Maybe just do a bit more practice and Google some new stretches and do them and hopefully they help. I'm sorry if this didn't work. For some people it doesn't. It depends on how flexible you are and how many steps you're taking to do it. And I just wanted to say, well, great job if you've completed this and... Goodbye! And the. Uh, wait, I forgot. And the challenge is to do a frog for five minutes. Bye!